Jody Ford is the new face of the Missouri Valley College football team. The new defensive backs coach came this fall 2016 to be part of the football staff. The former head coach of Central Methodist University has been coaching for 20 years and people from Missouri Valley are excited to have him coach for in the team. Very fortunate because uh, he was available. Coach Troth, Coach Rowe got a hold of him. Uh, he lives in Columbia now and they said, hey, you want to come over and be part of our staff? And Jody accepted and boy, he's a, he's a big help. And it, we're really fortunate to have him on our football staff here at Valley. For Coach Ford, being a coach is not only prepare kids to be good players, but also prepare kids to be men. The thing that I want with my guys is I got into coaching because I care about kids. I want to help kids become men. I want them. I get frustrated with what I see in society nowadays at times. Uh, you know, too many people are learning how to quit, give up, take the easy way out. There's not, kids, you know, aren't as tough. I hear older generations that are older than me talk about how wimpy our generation or younger generations are. And so my thing is I, I just want to make kids tougher. I want to prepare them to be better family people. I want to prepare them to be good husbands, good dads. It hasn't been an easy way for Coach Ford to be the man and the coach who is now. Coach Ford is a proud cancer survivor, but that never made him give up. There's not a trace of it in my family, and, and uh, so it was, it was a big, big surprise. I mean, I, I'm one of them guys that, you know, I think I'm going to go on forever sometimes, you know. And, and uh, so it, it hit me, you know, I'm 39 years old when this happens, and that's an awful young age to have that happen. Jody Ford is an example of improvement and perseverance, and that is what he wants to transmit to his players, because to learn to succeed, you must first learn to fail. I'm here today and feel like I'm pretty good at what I do today because I have failed a lot. And, um, you know, you have to learn from those failures. I mean, uh, and hopefully you have good people around you that have also failed so you can learn from they all, their failures. Um, uh, so I, I don't think anybody should ever be afraid of failure. Obviously, you don't want to. Um, you don't want to have to deal with negative situations. You always want to hit that big shot. And that's, uh, that's what I think people that um, should never be afraid of failure because it's only going to do good things for you if you just stay with it.